guys, welcome back to the channel. Today it's Alan and Sean reaction. Today we're going to be talking about two things. Firstly, we're going to talk about Shout and the exit in the Champions League uh, qualifiers. And also Rangers versus Mitchell in second leg. Uh, prediction. Prediction, yep. Um, just to quickly touch on the Shout again, they also lost 4 3 at home. A uh, very bad result, but as I said, and as a lot of Celtic fans have said to me, and as it is in the stats and that you can see, Neil Lennon's not good under pressure, and only being one, a uh, one each draw, um, away from home, you knew the pressure was right on him. Um, you knew he had to do something, to like, like this team. I never heard this team. That was from Romania. Um, apparently, the, I, I, I don't know, but I've seen uh, fucking hundreds of folk putting up the Romanian car washers and that. But I don't know. But uh, I mean, I, we all have embarrassing exit uh, um, results. Uh, no, no one can win all the time. Uh, they just try to, but they don't succeed. Well, I mean, if you've seen my Snapchat stories and my Twitter and that, you'll know how I felt about it. I, I think I retweeted everything today with the match, like every every thing um, that there was one as a folk just oh, it was it was great and that and there was even I saw some two folk tweeting and they were both still twenty and they were sitting there saying if you don't say Rangers kinda of challenge this season you're off your head and that because I feel like that's just gave them the kick saying right, we'll know as good as we think because obviously I mean, I I've never heard of this team. Nah, no, same. Um, but that's based on that. What about your thoughts on it, just quickly? Well, I'm half in the exit of the Champions League. Aye. But they have the cheek to call us the laughing stock of Scottish football. Mm -hmm. And they can't even beat a team. Aye, that Aye that, that's another thing. The guy, that's what the guy was saying. Uh, on Twitter, this guy was sitting there saying, we sit there and take the, uh, laugh at Sevco, as they call us, Sevco. Um, I think we should start taking responsibility of our own club and actual stop laughing at them because they're actually getting close and they, they, these two guys were just chatting about it and they're actually coming to their senses that we are back. No saying we're going to win the league. Well, it's a lie. So I want us to win the league, but it may not happen. And there's a bit in my brain, there's like 1% of my brain that th still thinks that might happen. But 99% of my brain and my heart says that we're going to win the league. There's just that 1% just in case it doesn't happen. But that's all. Celtic goes to Celtic. They're out. They're in Europa. Qualifiers with us now. They've got one. They're already in the playoffs. We win, as we're going to talk about. If we win, we're in the playoffs as well. And we could play Liga Warsaw. Uh, Liga Warsaw. Uh, Wait, I think we'll be a tough game. That's going to be the hardest game. If we get through that, then. If we get through that, then that's amazing. Like It's going to be the hard, the hard, hard game. But... We're the, way the, we, the way we started the season off, I think we beat him. We're up for the challenge, just, but... Just beat him. See, we'll say, oh, we'll scrape by them and that. And then we'll go and pump them. Mm, or we'll say, we'll go and pump them. And it'll be a close game. You can never call Rangers now. Like, like so look at Kelly. I went to Kelly, I was like... Oh, can't, even a Kelly fan, Mr. Hagel, Cammy Hagel, said that they were going to... Uh, we were going to smash them 6-0. We only beat them 2-1 in the last minute. Well, last minute goal. And look at Hibs. <laughs> we demolished Hibs. Like, I mean, what is there? Like, I don't know. I don't, I'd see for this Mitchell and as we're going to talk about now. I don't know. I can't even predict the game because Mitchell and I'm not at the tie. Gerard says it so many things in his press conferences and that the tie is not over. It takes one of their free kicks at Ibrox, turn the fans, the fans have grown. And we'll hope the players can also rise like they did against Hibs when Hibs scored and we managed to go on and get a third and then a fourth and a fifth and a sixth. But I mean, the tie's no over. Four away goals, yes, that's a lot, but it takes them three free kicks and they're right, that's them. Like, three free kicks and there's wide go away for bead eco. But I feel like we'll control the game. We're at home, home fans. As Gerard always says, he wants the fans to help him and his team out, and I think the fans will be 
amazing. We're always good, uh, but I think the fans will really be the key to this because the fans will cheer, they'll sing, the players just, I think the players just thrive on it. They just thrive on the, the, the singing and they're just like, let's go, get a result here. Aye. Aye. Uh, but quickly, prediction. I'll let Alan see what he thinks is going to happen, then I'll see my scoreline, then you see your scoreline. Yeah. Right. Uh, well, I'm thinking it will be a close mm -hmm. game, but I think we'll beat them at Ibrox. Mm -hmm. uh, I can't really say that if we've got to scrape by them or we've got to pump them. Mm -hmm. uh, but I think we'll beat them at Ibrox, but they won't give them a tough challenge. Uh, do you want to quickly do our team for tomorrow? What we think the team would be? And then we'll do our score. So yeah, quickly, I'm going, I'll go, I'll go and then he'll go. But if we agree, he'll just say shame. So I'm next, Alan McGregor. Aye, the the Shagger in next. Aye. Right back to have. Centre back Golson and Katic and uh, Flanagan at left back. Would you change any of them? I would change the left back to Haldy. Hmm. And then bring Flanagan on the other end. Uh, I think what he probably why would do Haldy on Flanagan comes on late or he'll play Flanagan and then bring Haldy on late because that's what he always does. Mm -hmm. Which I like because I like Haldy and I like Flanagan. I think Flanagan sucks out about it and so does thing about Flanagan's more uh, old fashioned left back. Right. Like he doesn't go up as much where he goes. He started to go up a lot more, but I, I mean, he can get back. He, and he's done it, he's done well ever since, right? So now, midfield. midfielders. Um, left wing, John Jones. Yeah, uh, right, left mid. No, no left wing. Left mid, John Jones. Right. Uh, Um, Ryan Jack uh, and no Stephen Davis and uh, what you call him? Stephen Davis. What the hell did you call him then? Arfield. That's it. Arfield. I don't know how I can remember, but I can remember him. Right. So that's John Jones, uh, Arfield, and Stephen Davis on the right. Ojo. And what were you? Would you change any of them? I would go left mid, John Jones. Mm -hmm. Two centre mids, Ryan Jack and Stephen Davis. Mm -hmm. And right mid, Joe Aribo. Oh, no, 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 I'm changing mine actually. Take Davis out there and play Aribo. Aribo and Arfield, I'd play them two. Aye. Them two in the mid, aye. I'd play them two. Um, no, two strikers. Two strikers. No, actually, what I'm doing is I'm putting a CDM in there. Right. And I'm going to put Ryan Jack there. So I'm going to play two le a left mid, a right uh, winger, two centre mid and a CDM. So Jack will drop down. So that'll be a 4-1-4-1. Four, one, four, one. Aye, one up front. Right. Aye. And also number one up top is Alfredo. And what about you, quickly? Uh, yeah. My two strikers. I'm going with Ojo and... You sure you want to play two strikers? Because I don't think he'll play. Uh, 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 that's, that's, what, that's what I'm saying. You sure you don't want to bring a CDM in? Or? No. I don't... Yeah. Gerard never plays two up front. I don't know why. It's just... I think it's because Manelos and Defoe don't work, but... I mean... I'm going with Ojo and Defoe up front. Uh -huh. That worked well against Hibs. Alright, so that's all on to it. Yeah. Basically, just what I say. Hope you're liking the intros. Also, I'm trying to do better things for the channel. Trying to make it better. Uh, but that's all for today, guys. This has been Alan and Sean. Reactions. And we'll see you tomorrow for the yeah. uh, the reaction video after the football. Right, see you later.